Hi everyone, this is Flo and today I want to show you how to install the last version of Blade uh, with Aroma, tweaks and a lot of things, uh, some mods also. And prerequisites are just to have unlocked the bootloader, have a uh, phone and flash the recovery and you must have flash the boot.img. All those videos and autos are on my YouTube channel so just check it. Then you must have put the different mods and uh, things on your HTC One X and you have to go to uh, wipe data factory and wipe cache just to clean it before doing everything. So let's go to wipe cache and wipe data factory. This is the full wipe just there and then you can go to flash the different uh, things. So first one is just to uh, go to install. This is there. Uh, install zip from SD card. Then you have to go to shoot zip from SD card. The first one just there. You can't read it. Then you go where you put your different files. So mine is ROM and Blade. And you can see there is uh, some uh, some different files. First one is Blade version 4.6. The last version is 4.7 with uh, just the boot animation added. Then you have to flash the Blade Aroma package and the other mods. So let's go for this one. Let's go to install it and wait. When it's done, you must to restart your phone just to be sure. Uh, and then you have to restart recovery mode. So let's go to wait the installation. So it's telling update. Just wait for it. So this is the sense uh, uh, blade. Then I will just introduce you the decent set version uh, because it's also amazing. This one is just 240 megabytes uh, and the over with the decent set is 144. So the installation is complete. You have to go back and reboot the system now before flashing the aroma. So it's security. So just wait one second and it restarts. Okay, so your phone is just uh, rebooting and you have to enter your PIN code. Then, you have to restart your phone. So you can see that I am on the Blade version with the wallpaper. Just wait one second. Okay, so just next. We don't have to, to use it right now. Next, 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 and next. Agree and agree. Okay, next, back. Done. Next, next, and finish. So this is the blade version, as you can see there, and there is the um, this is the blade with sense version, and we have now to flash the aroma. So let's go to close it, and no, okay, and we have to reboot it. So if we put restart, we can go to recovery just there, and let's go to restart on the recovery. And now we can flash the aroma with a lot of tweaks. So I am just updated with the last version, 5.0 is coming soon, uh, today. So you have to do the same thing with that, but there is different options and uh, you have just to follow it. So install with zip, install zip, choose zip, let's go to the blade folder there. And the, this is the first one, as you can see there, the blade aroma package 2.1. You have to check also the last version of this package and it start the aroma installer. So blade add-ons version 2.1. You have to click next and then next because you uh, agree with the requirements and agree the blade teams, uh, terms of use. Okay. You have to select which one you want. If you want to desense all but there is the new version with uh, the desense option. The remove rosy and white jets, remove sense lock screen and no GSense. So continue with HTC APKs, uh, will remain untouched and with the mods. Press next. Okay, back, back, excuse me. Back, back. Okay, you have now to choose your Rosy options. Landscape Rosy, Rosy with menu button support and landscape. So this is my favorite. Uh, or you can also choose Rosy 5 by 6 with landscape mod and portrait, and this is mine. Then you have the Liapota mods, 
uh, you can just select HTC Camera Jelly Bean Plus, Beats Disabler, uh, Hides Beats Audio Notifications, Power Saver, Advanced, and Overs. There is other modes as Disable Fast Dormancy, Disable Exchange Security, Lower Auto Brightness, Recent Apps Mode, NFC Mode, opens another menu with list of NFC modes, Sony X Loud Engines, uh, and Unsaid Sound, and other modded CPU configuration just for you. Okay, then you have to select the long press mode. Uh, hold back to kill apps, volume wake, use volume uh, rocker to wake the device and others as Liapoda mods pack, music pack, uh, beats audio tweaks and unset audio experience, mine. Okay, and then you have the uh, different mods, stock recent app, stock recent app uh, with green battery percent, with aluminium percent and AOSP with aluminium is my favorite. Then you have to check the NFC while uh, on lock screen or not when unlocked. NFC while screen on off. Uh, select what or if you want to restore any things. You want to restore the lock screen from HTC, the skins, ringtones, notifications, alarms, phone stream, HTC calendar, and Dropbox. So I have just to unselect some sums, ringtones, lock screen, and overalls. You have to press next. Choose the apps you want to add, so I don't want Go Launcher. Manage your Android from your computer web browser, so it's, it's, this is cool. Rotation lockers, 4.2.1 camera and gallery, and SIM tool and kit. Uh, install the camera and gallery from Android 4.2.1 with Photosphere, I don't want it, I prefer Vsense camera. Uh, MX player, ok, renovate, gaming boost and let's go to install it now. This is all the tweaks available on the Blade version. So after that I will show you how to switch and add different mods. So let's go just to restore it to awesomeness and let's go to reboot it. The phone is rebooting and then we are able to flush over mods I have to show you just now. So let's go rebooting. So then it's just upgrading all your applications. So it's optimizing everything. So there is for me 121 apps. And let's go to wait for it. Okay, so it's just starting because we finish it. And let's go to enter the pin code just there. And we get, for example, first of things is the aluminium battery just there. Then we get uh, the different things just there. We still haven't personalized the skins just there, as you can see, two different skins. We get also the scene just there, five, the lock screen style. And you can see how fast is this amazing custom ROM just there with no any options to, to wait. We have the Rosy 5.6, we get also Rotation Locker, just there. We have the Gaming Boost, we have the Android, just there. Enjoy your Android. I will show you that uh, later on my, uh, on my computer. We also get just the apps needed, and this is just something amazing. Okay, so then we have uh, the camera also just here, with those uh, options for just for then, just for four options here. So let's go to show you how to switch it and install the different mods uh, because I prefer it. So restart on the recovery mode. Okay, I am just preparing the next uh, review for the HTC One X and Desire HD for you. Okay, so the the phone is restarting. On recovery, just there. This time I am just patching the MIUI 00 set for Desire HD. So our phone is now uh, restarted, so let's go to use it. We have now to go on the install zip from SD card. Let's go to continue to choose zip from SD card and go to ROM Blade. And there is different things as the Liapota mod pack. I want to install it. Yes, install Liapota. So with this mod, uh, I will add the link on my description if you want. So we have just to check next, yes, next or so. 
we can just select the battery I want so I don't want to change because I have the aluminium and I love it but you can also select the green stock battery, green person battery, blue stock or blue person battery then you have the rosy mode you want I don't want because I prefer mine and then the camera options I prefer the camera extreme edition and you will see why because there is the six options and this is just so amazing you can also skip the stock camera and let's go to click next and it's just installing this uh, camera extreme edition mode and now you can reboot the phone or you can also add other modes so next finish now let's go to uh, shoe zip from SD cards, chill ROM and blade and we have to select HTC lock screen yes okay it's installing HTC lock screen just there and I want to also add you can just find this HTC lock screen and HTC skins on the blade thread XGA thread so let's go to install it don't forget to wipe the cache enjoy install from SD card and reboot the system now and we have to wait the reboot to enjoy our fun just there still the same thing Android is upgrading and we have to wait and now I get 129 apps so just wait for it okay so now it's restarting and what I love with this amazing custom arm is the battery life because I can use it for 17 hours without any issues so let's go to settings just there and start with the power if I get it okay so this is just uh, five minutes but I will reboot uh, later on the review with the uh, the backup okay so let's go to the camera and check the new mode just there as you can see there is six buttons and you get the camera just here with the different view scenes we get the uh, settings the switch camera excuse me just there we get the auto brightness with over modes we get uh, auto brightness and auto ISO and the flash mode just there so this is what I love with it then you can go to the settings here and go to the uh, personalize just there you have this scene here there is five scenes still there there is the skins and there is three new skins because you remember there is only two skins previously and the lock screen style there is no nine lock screen styles so I have added different styles thanks to the uh, XGA thread and the different mods okay so you maybe want I review it for you so let's go uh, to the review and you can see oh I have lost the 5x6 rosy mod sorry uh, okay so thanks to have seen this video that was flow and let's go to enjoy your installation